yeah, 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 yeah. Geeks, the Greeks, whatever. Yeah, yeah. They try to say like, hey, everybody come together, let's all be one. That's uh, pretty much what they did to us. Yeah. The Tower of Babel, let's be one. They're doing it now, let's be one. Let's, yeah. We don't want to fear nobody, so let's, let's just all just come together. Let's just make this religion all, you know, Jesus, yeah, Jesus, you know, he's uh, in this, whatever the fuck, let's add that nigga in. Or, you know what I mean? Yeah, because um, yeah, cause, yeah, cause Christmas is a universally accepted holiday. It's like it's like the New World Order holiday, ain't it? Yeah. You got Japanese people. They're fucking a bunch of... They don't even believe in the most high of Japan for the most part. They all celebrate it. Sorry. Every yeah. country on Earth celebrates Christmas now. Now, think about this. Just stop. Oh, why are you forgetting? God damn, that's crazy. I think it's the cold. Fuck yeah, the cold. Man. It's cold out here, boy. Damn, I really forgot. Like that. But every country on earth celebrate Christmas. You name a country, they got they got goddamn Santa Claus up there and all that. And they're not even so called Christians and they celebrate. That's what I was about to say. Think about it. If where the scripture says, be holy even as I'm holy, what's the word holy? We believe we be separated from me, right? I'm mistaken. We we, yeah, in Hebrew, yeah. So if you go to one person that doesn't believe in the Bible, this nigga don't give a shit. He say, hey, Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, he believes it. Now you go to a brother that believes in the Bible, and he said Merry Christmas, he said Merry Christmas. See, how's that separated? How's that any, any type of difference? One person says it's Jesus' birthday, but then another person say, well, you know, what the fuck they say. So nope. I'm saying, how, how, how? But, you can, but do unbelievers, do they do the, uh, the Passover? Hell no. You know what I'm saying? Did, do they do the work? Do they go on the highways and byways? And they claim to love the Bible so much, but do they get on the streets like us and teach? No, they don't. Well, first of all, they don't know nothing. What are they going to teach? First, you got to know stuff to teach it. They can't teach you shit. You sit out here with a thumbs up your ass. You know what I mean? These people are a fucking joke. Let's just say how it is. They're a fucking joke. The fuckers are worthless. These people are worthless. The average imbecile is a worthless imbecile. Fucking piece of shit. They're fucking foolish. This is Christmas shit. Yeah, buy a humbug the fucking Christmas. That's what, and because I looked that word by humbug up, you know, from Scrooge, they, just, they come up to Scrooge, you know, from the Christmas Carol with uh, Ebenezer Scrooge, you know, the ghost of Christmas present, ghost of Christmas past. Man, they must not teach that to the young folk today. But yeah, Ebenezer Scrooge, every time someone say Merry Christmas to him, he go by humbug. But you look that word by humbug up, it means fraudulent. Because he was telling them that Christmas was a fraud. And it is a fraud. It's a fake. It's a phony. Cause, you know, uh, who was talking shit? Somebody, I heard somebody scoffing. I think he talked about that. Uh, all right. I'm about to say, I knew the scoffer's going to find a way. Where there's a will, there's a way in a scoffer. What was I think? I just had a good point. Oh, yeah, because one of the big reasons, too, the church is uh, celebrate Christmas. It's because when they were, when uh, they was converting a lot of pagans, they would let the pagans keep their old. Hey, give me that. Uh, 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 I'll get it. First Corinthians. I made a video on this earlier today, but I'll keep reading it, the scriptures, the same scriptures. Sometimes you just gotta get the same scriptures over and over again. You know what I mean? Because obviously the message ain't getting through. If somebody ain't listening, to, they ain't hear you the first time, what do you say it again? They don't hear it again, you keep repeating until they fucking get it. Oh my goodness, <laughs> can I turn the pages? Damn. See, I can't get to the 10th chapter. <laughs> yeah, so, let's say. Must be one of them frost giants. Fucking uh, but yeah, but what Christmas comes from? Because you know when Chris, uh, so-called Christianity was blowing up, uh, they they would convert pagans and and uh, uh, they they would allow them to keep practicing their other festivals. So, because really, what happened is when Constantine the Great became emperor in the Roman Empire, he wanted to unify the whole empire under one faith, and that's why he started merging pagan beliefs. And with the Bible because he wanted to unify the empire. And the same thing happened with the rest of Europe, with the uh, with the Norse tribes, when the, when the Catholic Church was going up there trying to convert all the Vikings and all that. They would allow them to keep their pagan customs as long as they uh, converted and bowed the knee to the Catholic Church pretty much. It really is all politics. 
Oh, shit. But you can't be mixing pagan beliefs in with the Bible. And they'll say, uh, I've heard a lot of pastors say that. They'll say, uh, Christmas is good because it means that Christianity conquered paganism. And we just absorbed all their holidays as a sign that we conquered them. Oh, that's no. uh, Let me read this. This is a perfect scripture. 1 Corinthians 10 and 21. Damn. You cannot drink the cup of the Lord and the cup of devils. You cannot be partakers of the Lord's table and the table of devils. Do we provoke the Lord to jealousy? Are we stronger than he? All things are lawful for me, but all things are not expedient. All things are lawful for me, but all things edified not. Well, I mean, that's the point, pretty much. I mean, you can't drink at the cup of the Lord and the, the cup of devils. You can't sit at the table of the Lord and the table of Satan at the same time. Because we, we know for a fact that, you know, Christmas is pagan. It comes from the ancient pagan festivals. And you can't call yourself being a Bible believer and celebrating pagan holidays. It don't work like that. Okay, that's not how that works. That's not the way the Most High said it. He said, like you said, you're supposed to be separate. Then that Jeremiah 10 said, learn not the ways of the heathen. You know what I'm saying? For the customs of the people are vain. And they cut a tree out of the forest, the hands of the workmen and axe. They, they put it in their house and they deck it with silver and gold. You know? Okay, keep them pushing. I got some scripture. What's that one I hate? I despise your face. There's Amos saying it. Huh? Damn, I can't even turn the page. This is Amos. Shit. My hands are they get they out of there. Amos 5 and 21. Actually, let me just Amos 5 and 20. Shall not the day the Lord be darkness and not light, even very dark and no brightness in it? That's the something your pastor. Their pastor ain't go, you gonna come to find out he ain't gonna teach you none of the same things that we teach. You know? Then they're not gonna teach that one. So the day the Lord is darkness and not light. And that makes sense, because look at all the darknesses in the world. You know what I mean? So the Lord, ah, you know, uh, give unto you, well, according to your own works. Uh, oh, shit. I, uh, let me read that again. Amos 5 and 20. Shall not the day of the Lord be darkness and not light, even very dark and no brightness in it? I hate, I despise your feast days, and I will not smell in your solemn assemblies. So the Lord said he hates them feast days. The Lord hates it when you celebrate Christmas. Yeah, that's not in the Bible. Easter's not in the Bible. Thanksgiving ain't no Bible. Halloween, definitely not in the Bible. None of the holidays ain't celebrated in the Bible. Not one of them. Not a single one. Y'all couldn't even get one. You think they at least get one? They didn't even get one. They took the Sabbath and put it on Sunday. He fucked that up too. You can't get nothing right. Pass it, pass it, pass it Johnson. Bitch ass, they gonna celebrate the Passover. Hell no, he ain't celebrating no Passover. Oh hell no! Could, could you imagine if they kept them on the Day of Atonement? The scriptures say we supposed to afflict our bodies for a day. I mean, we're not supposed. We're supposed to go 24 hours with no food and no water. Can you imagine Pastor Johnson, Pastor Polk Chop, told his congregation they wasn't allowed to eat or drink for a whole day? Man, they're gonna leave his church. They're like, no, Pastor, no, you can't be starving your children, Pastor. <laughs> yeah, I rebuke you in the name of Jesus. What about my babies? My babies is hungry. I see you worse, motherfucker. That's what they say on Christmas. I can't believe you don't let your you don't celebrate Christmas. What about your babies? What about your children? 
that, that's some torture, actually. You gotta wait, you gotta make this motherfucker wait for a whole goddamn year to just get a little. Yeah, you put it in the closet for like a year, <laughs> making wait for it. What if he got hit by a bus and he yeah. never got his presents? Oh. Like he could have been had it and enjoyed his life a little bit, cause you don't know what could happen. You don't know if your little baby gonna be alive. From, you don't know if you gonna be alive from the one day to the next. That's take no thought for tomorrow. That's going against that scripture. You're putting up presents, hiding them. Then they say the elves made the presents. <laughs> Fucking elves is uh, come from North mythology too. The little elves are mischievous creatures, little mischievous spirits. That's that's all Norse mythology. Elves, Santa Claus is Odin, A.K.A. Baal, the devil. My fingers are frozen. They cold. They about to fall off. <laughs> Why is it so cold out here? I was gonna get this magic 10. A magic 6. Cause it's really hard to get these pages right now. Matthew 6 and 24. No man can serve two masters, for he will either hate the one and love the other, or else he will hold to the one and despise the other. You cannot serve God and man. When you look that up, you know, God and man is what God of riches, right? You know how in the Bible it says you're not supposed to worship the groves? Because uh, when you work, because a Christmas tree is pretty much just a grove, and the Bible says that you're supposed to burn the groves with fire, and it, all through the Old Testament, through the Book of Judges, Chronicles, all that, the Israelites always became wicked, and they would always worship Baal in the groves. Now, when you look at word groves is up in Hebrew, you're gonna find that the word grove actually means Asher, which is Baal's wife, and that's the Queen of Heaven. She's known as the Queen of Heaven, and uh. She's a Canaanite goddess of fertility. And she's also a goddess of good fortune. They say a goddess of fortune, because she brings you uh, fortune and, I guess, wealth. The same thing with the god of mammon, because Christmas is really worshiping the god of mammon, which all goes back to the devil. It goes back to Baal worship. It's all the same shit. Baal worship is uh, to worship the devil. To be a devil worshiper and to be satanic means that you don't care about anything spiritual. You only care about your flesh. You only care about pleasing your flesh and, uh, you know, fulfilling your carnal desires, you know. That, that's pretty much what Satanism is all about. The, the fulfilling of the flesh and the flesh only. Like, 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 how you got the holidays in this world, you get, you get food, you get fat, you know what I'm watch a game, whatever, but we, on our so-called well, holy, holy days, yep. we gotta, we gotta uh, starve ourselves. We gotta fix our souls. Yep. Yeah. But Dave, right now, you can't fix our souls right now. We're fixing our souls right now. <laughs> yeah, we out here free. Yeah, and we probably ain't gonna do a pool a whole shift today because it's so damn cold. Hey, but hey, we came out here though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I bet we've been out here about an hour. Hey, it's fucking cold today. It's... I was not ready for this. My hands are gone. So you put your fingers in your hands in the pocket. That shit works. Like yeah. And we had a little crowd just now too, so the word don't go out void. Plus, it's going on the internet, and you know. Hey, shit! Hey, Isaiah prophesied for three years naked, butt ass naked. Man, he can, he can teach you three years. I wanted to come out here today anyway, to, just to curse out Christmas. I just hate Christmas, but we know they're not gonna stop celebrating Christmas. Man. You're like you're fucking delusional if you think. They people are gonna stop celebrating Christmas. Like they all of a sudden just gonna stop. No, nah, you know they gonna stop when the Lord bring that fire from the heavens. When he when he destroys it, when they they all gotta die. It's just like when the Israelites, when the, the Most High delivered Israel out of Egypt, when they did what? They walked through the Red Sea, and he killed the Pharaoh and the army. But when the Israel got to the to the wilderness, what did Israel do? They sinned. And they started doing what? Worshiping the bull. Worshiping the devil. Right? So uh so the most high jacked all Israel up and he said what? I 